Hello everybody, this is a review of Breck Farm Camping, which is Weybourne, which is at Weybourne near Holt in Norfolk. It's a lovely quiet campsite, um, costs £19 per night and a couple of quid extra per night for electric. Um, they're very, very chilled out and flexible here, no ch extra charges for dogs. Um, don't know if they charge extra for awnings, um, you'd have to check their website for that. but. Um, very very chilled out um, everything is all just when you when you pay for non-electric you basically just park in this field and you can basically park wherever you like so you just set up camp wherever you feel comfortable and it's lovely so uh, well worth a visit 19 pound a night as I say a couple of quid extra for electric no electric in this field but if you go just over where those vans are over there there's electric no there isn't Electric on that side of the field, um, and but in the rest of the field, say no electric. Um, the further field, which you can see further onto those camper vans, that's basically where the electric fields are. So we'll go on over and look at those a bit later. Right, this is a bit more of Breck Farm Camping. This is one of the electric fields, um, and there's one the other side. Um, there's a few statics over there, but I don't believe you can hire them. I believe they're just for staff or people that own them. Um, over there, just to be just in that direction, you just see the top of the roof. That's the toilet and shower block. Obviously, currently closed at the moment because today is the uh, the twenty something of April. Um, so we're still on the second stage of the lockdown restrictions lifting. They will open on the 17th of May anyway. Uh, they look all clean, um, clean and tidy, but I haven't seen inside them because it's the first time that I've ever been here. Um, this little bit here is the entrance road in. Um, quite a nice entrance road, I would say. Reception is just literally over there. You can see the sign there pointing to it. And it's that, it's that sort of stone built house just there. That's reception. Uh, very friendly. Um, it's got a little shop in there. They sell odd things like drinks and that. Um, but yeah, it's a very, very nice site. Um, if I find anything else of interest as we go out, I will uh, put another video on. All right, brilliant. Thank you very much. All right, we jo you join us at the washing facilities, washing up facilities at Brake Farm. Um, not the greatest I've ever seen, to be honest. They're, they're not undercover, and the taps are just these standard outside taps. So they splash everywhere. So just a little improvement you could do um, is just um, basically just put some uh, little things on the end so they don't splash everywhere but other than that they're great toilets look clean enough obviously not open at the moment but they look clean enough yep so this is Brick Farm we're going soon and there's a the final view and we finish up the review of Brick Farm camping so excuse the car going by um, this is the sign this is the entrance road in as you can see, and it's lovely, it's uh, it's uh, how many times have I said that on this video, it's lovely. It's a lovely site, um, you're right on the, uh, you're in a working farm by the way, uh, but they're totally separate. You can hear the cows mooing in the morning. You've got forest just over there. So it's just brilliant, it's in the middle of nowhere, literally. It's in way, a place called Weybourne, which is near Holt. Not far away, about an hour's walk from Holt and it's about an hour's walk from Sheringham, 10 minutes either way in the car. So uh, yeah, surrounded by fields, absolutely lovely. Suggest you come and have a visit here if you uh, are in the area, 19 pound a night, and then a couple of quid extra for electric. Absolutely wonderful site. Come and visit soon, I'll put a link to the their website in the, uh, in the description below. I look forward to speaking to you on the next review. This has been Mark on Campervan Parking for Real Campervans.